Hey, what's up? What's up? What's up? This is James again, and I'm, of course, uh, if you've been following me very long, you know I'm into several different things, um, silver, and um, I also am into crypto, and on the screen right now, you see the Twitter. I'm talking about XRP. Make sure, before we get started, make sure you subscribe, share, and uh, connect with us on all of our uh, social media channels around this video. And we hope that you will uh, really connect with us. And uh, thank you, thank you, thank you for all those that are subscri subscriptions and the, those that are uh, subscribing sp specifically on uh, Rumble. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Of course, uh, I'm shooting this to my YouTube Vimeo daily motion and then on to all my uh, different Facebook pages so make sure you subscribe and comment if you're in comment below if you are in uh, if you have a uh, cryptocurrency all right we are talking crypto this last weekend there is a few things that that was happening but crypto 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 here is something that is going to happen the uh, XRP uh, Jack the Ripper, XRP Adoption Boost, Ripple confirms partnership with Bank of America. I know that some of you, of course, Bank of America is have have some connections to some shady characters, I, I will agree, but XP, uh, XRP Adoption Boost, Ripple confirms partnership with Bank of America, Ripple Swell Conference turned out to bring some pretty interesting news during a presentation. Let's jump over to the the uh, the article Ripple Swell Conference um, the presentations featured demos from XRP ODL and messaging system the presentation featured mock demos of both Ripple's XRP powered cross-border payments products ODL and the messaging system that's not based on um, XRP these demos tr triggered maximum enthusiasm among investors and advocates of XRP. They also triggered a debate on how the Bank of America is using Ripple's network of banks and financial institutions. So basically what, what is happening is this is, they're linking up, they're, they're linking up with banks and it's a, it is a payment system. Many of you have probably transferred money using ACH well, this is kind of the same scenario, but it's XRP, which will be immediate, immediate um, transfer. So let's, let's jump back over here. And also, Ripple co-founder, XRP can replace SWIFT as payment system. Wow. Wow. Here's the article. Ripple co-founder co XRP can replace Swift as payment system. Um, he said his uh, the Blockstar's uh, podcast after his recovery from COVID-19 virus, Larson expressed his views on Bitcoin and the development of the crypto market. He also talked of the blockchain technology and the crypto crypto movement what it means for the process of the global financial system. So, this jump down. XRP as an alternative for SWIFT. And if you understand the banking system, that is what the payment system on in the banking system, they use SWIFT currently. Larson then spoke about Ripple cor uh, corridors and the technology that enables cross-border payments. This is This is really, really going to be important. You know the biggest impediment of the crypto industry is regulation and the legal framework. Ripple is one of the companies most involved in the search for a clear regulation, a robust legal framework for the crypto industry. The company opened a branch in Washington to work with regulators to solve this problem. So they are really wanting to do it do it correctly. But Finally, Larson discussed the potential of XRP to replace the SWIFT payment system. Larson said the technology, that, get this folks, if you're not into to crypto, you need to take a look at crypto. XRP would be a viable 
alternative to the traditional system as opposed to proof of work models. This is because XRP Ledger does not rely on a group of miners. Consequently, there is no risk of a 51% attack. Otherwise, Larson also pointed out the high energy consumption required by cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin, but replacing replacing the SWIFT payment system. So can you imagine, I haven't done the research of how much the payments per day are done in the worldwide or even USA-wide banking system, but if XRP would be part of that, oh my goodness, it's, it's right around 24, 25 cents right now, a coin, get in on it, get in on it. All right, I ask you to subscribe, share. That's all I wanted to bring to you today, October 19th. I wanted you to know that if you're not in crypto, this can be a life-changing time. It's important. Be involved. Get involved. All right, thank you for watching. We'll catch you on the next uh, video. Subscribe, share, like. Click the links around this, this video. Connect with us. Thank you much. We hope you have a great day.